नमस्कार आशीष मित्तल फ्रॉम आरसन वर्ड्स एंड इन दिस वीडियो वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट द वार्ड रोब्स क्रॉकरी यूनिट एंड टीवी यूनिट एंड हियर वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट द कॉन्सेप्ट दैट इज रिक्वायर्ड टू अंडरस्टैंड अबाउट दीज यूनिट्स क्रॉकरी यूनिट्स ऑल्सो नोन एज डिस्प्ले यूनिट्स और डिस्प्ले शेल्फ दे आर इन यूज फॉर अ वेरी लॉन्ग टाइम एंड इन ओल्ड मूवीज एंड इन द रिसेंट मूवीज एवरीवेयर यू सी अ क्रॉकरी यूनिट वार्ड रोब इज पार्ट ऑफ एवरी होम everybody needs some uh, place to keep their uh, clothes their uh, other stuff and that's why every bedroom have a wardrobe and tv units though the concept has changed quite a lot because uh, earlier we have very big tvs very broad tvs now we have very slim leds and that also goes on wall i'll explain the concept in a little bit let's start with the wardrobe first so wardrobes are generally two door three door four door five door six door depending entirely on the space we have how much the space is that defines what ward wardrobe do we require let's see this one this is 3 and 1/2 feet 42 inches left to right it's a two door almira wardrobe closet you can call it by any name it has got two doors here and then we have got a locker inside space to keep some essentials here and if you see we have uh, provided a provision for the rod as well to hang the clothes we'll put the rod here and uh, it'll be for the hanging purpose then we have drawers one two and then we have cabinet area and these are with locks so cabinet one and cabinet two height of this unit is 6 and 1/2 feet and the depth is 20 inches depth is quite an interesting thing because uh, generally we we think that wardrobes are very deep but 20 inches is a standard depth for a wardrobe because that can easily accommodate your hangers when you hang the stuff inside you can go for 22 or 24 also but deeper than that goes very deep so 22 24 inches maximum depth for a wardrobe this is in teak wood and you can see the carving everywhere with a little brass work here we have a little brass work on the designing part and this is one of the most classical designs of wardrobes that we have available it has got carving on the sides as well so three sides carving the back is always plain for a wardrobe because wardrobe is essentially going to a wall now looking at the overall design you can see the beautiful leg work of this unit and the design itself with a teak finish pu polish and the gloss finish that we have in this unit so for a compact wardrobe if you are looking for a smaller size this one is quite good and you can go for this size going with the bigger one we have one here this is a three door 5 feet left to right depth again 20 inches height 6 and 1/2 feet and again the lock part here one door two door and then we have one door on the side this is the third door and again the locker part then three drawers and three cabinets depth is again 20 inches as i mentioned the standard depth that can be increased or reduced if you require height can be increased or reduced as per the requirement now in wardrobe when we talk about the concept the major concept is the storage part you don't want the cabinets let's say you want all drawers or you want bigger drawers or you want to hang let's say inside in this we have the provision we haven't put the rod yet we'll put that so here we have a rod area then we have this shelf then the storage area underneath you want to to design it yourself you want more shelves you want more drawers inside or a hidden locker these are the concepts that we are talking about and even if you draw on a paper that this is the size and provide me a drawer here provide me a shelf here accordingly we do that so the designing part is entirely your choice teak wood pu finish and the gloss finish and the design you can see overall again very nice carving work this doesn't have the brass work just like the earlier one it has got complete wood design and this is what we make here the artisan work another question majorly that client ask is is it complete teak wood full unit is teak wood and the answer is no we don't make the unit in complete wood because complete wood would require very heavy planks of wood 
if you talk about this unit at the back you can see there's a big plain plank and if you are putting this heavy wood here the unit would be very heavy and also we require very thick wood because thin wood tends to bend with time with the temperature with climate changes and uh, generally we don't recommend that also so in that case we use ply so all the carving area that you see everywhere every carving is on wood and the rest inside area the drawer inside area back area is teak ply ply cannot be carved you cannot get carving on ply so that is why it's very visible what part is teak wood and what is ply is clearly visible here and this is very open there's nothing that we have hidden here is clearly visible right here teak wood has its own texture design color and this is what people like across the globe and this is one of the best colors according to me when you're using teak furniture then we can go for wooden finish however in modern times in modern days there are a lot of colors that are playing around and then we have the inside interiors with the wallpapers and the false ceiling and the profile lights led lights and these louvers and all these new things that are coming in play for which people are loving different colors also and we have made units in almost all the colors now dual shade triple shade even gold leafing champagne leafing and uh, white off white with highlighting gold highlighting and uh, Antique gold is all, always uh, the most like color. Then we have silver, then we have uh, rose gold. So colors are unlimited. But what you like, we make that. Let's move on to this one. This is five and a half feet left to right. And it's a crockery unit. Or we can call it a display unit also. This area would require glasses. So all these places will have glasses. And inside shelves would be put once it is on site. We don't provide it from here. Because uh, these are fragile items and uh, once the glasses are shipped from here, it can break anytime. And no transporter takes guarantee of glass items. So we always prefer that on site this is done. And trust me, this is not a difficult job. Thousands of customers have already bought the stuff like this only we have delivered. And they have got the glass part done. Every city have glass people because every building requires some glass work in the windows, in other areas. And they come on site and do it. And this is very easy work for them. So we'll ship it out and it will be delivered there. And then the glass work is done. The height of this one is seven and a half feet. And the design, you can see the platform is 30 inches from the ground. Uh, underneath we have a, a storage area. And if you can see it, this is one of the most difficult part to get the curve in wood. Because wood comes in straight planks. And this curve requires a lot of artesian work. The wood is joined so artistically that it takes bent shape if you ask a carpenter to do it they generally would do it in ply or some other uh, soft stuff that can be bent but wood cannot be bent and that is the kind of artistic work we are talking about here so curve here curve on that side and overall it's a beautiful design of a crockery unit and we have so many designs of crockery units on our website arsonwoods.com and for every unit that i'm showing you Again, it's your choice how you want to change the design. You want some part uh, to be carved more, some other carving. You want uh, different drawers. Here we have bigger drawers and three drawers right in the middle and two drawers on the side. Again, in the curvaceous form. Here you can see the curve on the front part of the drawer. This was about the display units or crockery units. And even if you want the, just the lower part, that is also called sideboard or uh, chest of drawers, also people call it. They can provide the lower part only. And if you want the top part only, you want to uh, make some adjustment on the wall, hang it there. Something like that can be done also. Now I'll move to the last item in this video is a TV unit. And TV unit has very interesting concept. First of all, the TV size. Whenever people call this, let's say they are calling 42 inches or 48 inches or any size they are calling. The size is not the actual size. The size is diagonal. On the box, whenever the size is printed, it's diagonal size. What we require is the length and the height. And if you go online and type anything for any size, for any TV, you will get the length and size. Now, how does it work? Let's say this is the unit. This one is six and a half feet wide, left to right. 
depth is 22 inches this is a little uh, broader and the height is 2 feet if you are putting a tv on wall the tv unit is completely for the decoration purposes only these days we don't have a lot of uh, gadgets along with the tv earlier we used to have the dvd players the vcrs before that time and then we have the set top boxes and things are slowly moving to a slow, smaller size these days tv units are mostly for the decoration purposes you can keep vases shields mementos designer items on the tv unit and the and the tv goes to a wall if you are keeping the tv on the unit itself then again, the size of the unit does matter. So any size of TV you have, a little bigger on both sides is good enough. That is fine. And then we have area here. The open area is for the additional items. You may have some uh, Xbox or uh, some uh, uh, DVD player, still you are using it, or some other stuff, you can keep it here and the wires gets connected from the back. This is how the concept works. Then we have the storage part, and again in teak wood, and PU gloss finish, teak finish. Height of the TV unit completely depends on how you want to use the TV, on the wall or on the uh, unit itself. The optimum height for any TV, the proper height for any TV is when you are sitting across the unit, the middle of the TV should be the eye level. Let's say you are sitting on uh, a sofa across the unit. Now, when you are sitting that side, you are sitting on around 20 inches height. And let's say we have a two and a half feet height from off the ground. So, four and a half feet high. So, four and a half feet is the optimum height. So, you can place the TV here and the eye level would be like this. So, this is the best way if you want to check where to place the TV. If you, if you still need to understand it more, you can always call us and uh, we can let you know how it works. But broadly, this is the concept. So, TV goes to the wall or to the unit. And the size is left to right and height. This is how it is calculated. Rest is a design part. And colors, sizes, designs, everything is customized as per the client's choice. So we have option in everything. Bespoke furniture made in Bharat by local artisans. 55 plus countries. We are an international trademark registered in 35 countries. And we are doing business everywhere. And we are blessed with your orders and we are happy that we are able to give work to so many local people just because you have trusted us and you have blessed us with your orders. On our website, there is a section, see what other clients have bought. You can check that section and you will find thousands of actual pictures from across the globe, what people have bought. That can give you a better idea. What would look good in your place, in the interiors like yours. There are several pictures there and that will give you a much better idea. Still, if you have any question, any requirement, the number is right here. Anytime you can contact us, we'll be happy to answer your queries. We deliver internationally and all India and at factory price because we make the unit here. Then when manufacturers, there is no trader or middleman in the middle. So you get the best price and the best deal from Arson when you buy directly. If you have any questions, number is right here. Thank you. Dhanyavad.